What's up, y'all? Hey, I'm out here on this new smoker I've been talking about on the previous videos. And what it is, it's a small upright vertical. And I haven't been doing them. I do a bigger version of it, uh, 24 by 24. This is a smaller 20 by 20. And I'm already cooking on it. I just got back from church and I'm fixing to open the door and get ready to wrap this brisket in here. So anyway, let's take a look at it right quick. This is the smoker. Like I say, it's 20 by 20. Slide vent on the firebox, two thermostats. I hadn't even looked in it since I got back from church, so hopefully everything's good. Stack on the top. It has a folding table on the side, a, a tent port in the side. So anyway, let's take a look at it right quick, see what we got. I know I gotta get it wrapped. It's been in there about two and a half hours. I knew that little piece was gonna get ate up. So everything's looking good in there. Has three racks, has a water pan. I done cooked all the water pan, the water out of there. But anyway, when I get done with this, I'll come back and show you the stuff that's on there. That's different than uh, the bigger one that I was doing. Now the plate on the inside, the diverter plate, it's removable. So where you can pull it out and you can direct grill down there over the fire if you wanted to. Or you could even use that plate as a griddle, uh, just a flat griddle on there. So anyway, I'm going to get this stuff wrapped up. And then we'll come back and take a look at it. After. All right, we got the brisket done. Nice little smoke ring on there. And got the other one right there. Really all this is is the thick end. If you buy like a 14, 15 pound brisket, the thick end of it, I just split it in half. And that it's about three quarters of an inch, whatever fat in, right in between those. And then took that fat out. I just split it right there and made two flats with it. But this is the smoker, 20 by 20 upright vertical. It has three racks. I put one up there so you can see in there. That's the water pan. It ran out of water, got some ash in it. And what I was saying earlier is that diverter plate that's right under there, it's now removable. Oh, that sucker's still hot. Where you can pull it out of there and direct grill down there. If you wanted to, you could put one of the racks down in there or just direct grill with the rack right there. But anyway, I'm gonna come back and do another video of it after it cools off and everything and I can actually touch the thing. Right now I'm fixing to go in here and get started on this brisket. So, um, yeah, that, that's the, a new model of the vert, upright vertical that I'm doing. Uh, it is for sale right now. I'm gonna come back and do a video with the price and everything on it because this one I just gotta get this video over with. And plus I can't touch it right now, it's too hot. But anyway, man, uh, if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. I'm gonna do more cook videos on this and hopefully sell a whole bunch of these. And uh, if, you're new to, if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe and come back for the next one, man. We'll see you then.